everyone welcome to another video in the journey began with eva youtube series in today's video we will be talking about how long it takes to make one dollar here on youtube we will also be talking about how long it takes for you to get your first paycheck from youtube so this video is dedicated to the beginner content creators who have just launched their youtube journey and to those who have just gotten their youtube channels monetized or rather accepted to the youtube partnership partnership program meaning that you can finally get paid for your hard work and also number three this video is dedicated to those who are still who are still not decided on whether to start a youtube channel or not well you better start now you better start today starting a youtube channel is not hard you only need a gmail account then sign into youtube and start recording something post it for us to watch and enjoy or learn from so the ball is on your side if you are interested in uh, content creation then what are you waiting for start your journey today in fact start now back to our topic of the day how long does it take to make one single dollar from youtube this is a question i was asked by one of my friends who was really mad because his channel is monetized so actually the title of this video was inspired by him for the beginners who have just launched their youtube journey for you to get accepted to the youtube partnership program meaning that you can earn from your youtube videos you should have met the fresh mark of 1000 subscribers and 4000 public watch hours for you to be accepted in the youtube partnership program so if you are not not yet there please do not give up because every small step forward puts you closer to your goal so please do not give up even if you are at 20 subscribers you are at 150 you are at 600 1000 subscribers is just around the corner so don't give up keep pushing every content creator or youtuber rather is always eagerly waiting for that a message from youtube that congratulations your youtube channel has officially been accepted to the youtube partnership program it is the best news any youtuber can receive from this youtube platform because it guarantees you that finally you can start earning from your hard work then number two which will put even a bigger smile on your face is finally uh, seeing adverts play in your videos which you have to activate for every single video that you have in your channel then the third thing finally logging into a youtube studio and you see that well finally i have started making some few dollars it is the best feeling ever but a big question comes in how long does it take for you to make that one single dollar it will be dependent on several factors number one it will be dependent on how many views you have gotten in your videos and where your viewers are located because there's that one there's that thing called the cpm cost per mileage which are basically uh, covers where your viewers are located because some countries have a higher P CPM than others meaning that I might be having 1000 subscribers and another person has like 5000 subscribers but I'm making more money than that person who has 5000 subscribers simply because my CPM is higher than his or her CPM so you have those are some of the technicalities that you, sh you should understand as a youtuber your cpm is very important you have to be very very strategic in your videos because you know content creation is hard work 
and the more views you get and the more diverse your viewers are the more income you're going to earn from youtube doesn't that sound like music to your ears so ensure that your content is diverse and also ensure that you keep being consistent in your posting another thing you'll need to understand if your channel has recently been monetized if previously before monetization you are creating uh, short videos of like three minutes one minute four minutes try and create longer videos at least make them 10 minutes if you can at least try and make your videos 10 minutes which will earn you the privilege of having uh, uh, an advert at the middle of your video how are you going to make sure that you have a 10 minutes video which is really engaging and it will keep your viewers glued until they watch the video up to the end make your videos fun make your videos interactive make you know make them interesting i know some of you will be fasting and praying that one of their videos will go viral and they will make all the money they envisioned making here on youtube well before you go to fasting and praying ensure that you are creating enough content in your channel if you can manage posting once in a week ensure that you do that if you can manage posting two videos in a week do that if you can manage posting thrice in a week daily in a week it all depends on you so just remember the more you keep creating the more you keep learning and also the more you will earn from your videos so apart from making money from uh youtube ads you can make money through paid partnerships you can make money through affiliate marketing you can even start your own merchandise you can uh, also earn from uh, people sending you super chats which is not available in all countries so there are several methods of making money as a content creator but first before you venture into something, ensure that you properly understand it. That is a free advice to all of you. I'm advising you people as I advise myself. Always before you venture into something, ensure that you understand it very well. But I had forgotten this one of having our channel memberships. You can be having some uh, special content for a certain number of people who have uh, accepted to join your uh, your channel membership program i'm still trying to understand how to create mine well i know it's not a complicated process that's why i've told you people that before you venture into something first ensure that you understand it better for you to avoid being disappointed or to avoid embarrassing yourself it will also save you headache it will save you time headache and what and resources yes so you can make money from channel memberships you can make money from people sending you super chats when you are premiering videos or when you are doing live streams you can make money from affiliate marketing paid partnership you can start your own merchandise you know ensure that you're creating content that you're passionate about that is one way of avoiding content burnout and also one way of ensuring that you are consistent in your channel because if you are doing something that you're not enjoying doing it's gonna be hard for you my brother my sister it's gonna be hard for you so if you want to keep enjoying your content creation journey if you want to keep uh, your viewers entertained to keep coming back to watch your videos ensure that you're doing something that you love something that you're good at 
content creation is diverse you can make videos on uh, cooking you can create videos on reviewing uh, reviewing gadgets you can uh, stick to travel vlogs if you enjoy um, if you enjoy educating people you can do that you know content creation is diverse I'm not telling you not to explore but ensure that you first especially if you are a beginner ensure that first you concentrate on on uh, building your audience they are the people who make you who you are they are the people who keep motivating you to keep doing what you're doing so in this day and age when everyone is creating content what is that one thing that makes you stand out what is that one thing which will make your viewers come back to watch your videos or it will attract new viewers to join your youtube channel ensure that you're doing something that you're passionate about and also something that you are knowledgeable about don't be too worried when you're starting because you know you are evolving as a content creator and the more you keep creating the more you keep learning well it is not easy to identify a niche at the beginning unless when you are very specific at the be beginning you are like i will concentrate on cooking i will concentrate on a uh, hair videos i will concentrate on um, travel vlogs you know once you start when you already you already have a niche in your mind it is easier for you but if you're still maneuvering you're still not sure of what will work to your advantage please don't get discouraged just keep doing what you're doing at some point you'll see what is working for you and once you identify what is working for you hold on to that and run with it maximize with it because hey youtube some people might say that youtube is saturated but honestly everyone in this world has a story to tell well at one point you might be experiencing content burnout which uh, I think I tackled that topic in one of my videos about content burnout. Well, it is real. Even the big YouTubers at some point uh, go through content burnout. So what do you do? Your channel has been accepted to the YouTube partnership program. Here you are knowing that every single view, every single video that you're creating is guaranteed that it will earn you some revenue but you are confused even the ideas you had in your mind have escaped they have disappeared that is why you should always have a pen and paper always not down your ideas because they'll not stick in your mind forever make your pen and paper a friend because once you have an idea and not it down, you can always refer to it later on, think through it and see how you can incorporate it in one of your videos. We are human beings. We forget. We forget stuff. And especially these days when uh, there's so much happening around you, content creation is overwhelming. Let's not lie to each other. It's overwhelming. That's why you have to identify um, a niche which you are passionate about and also you are knowledgeable about it will be easier for you that way otherwise if you keep guessing if you are all over it will be so hard for you so just, just sit down and uh, identify which niche works best for you you will start enjoying content creation it's not it's not that hard once you've mastered what you're supposed to do and what is working for you well one way of overcoming content burnout is you know english is not my first language so i'm just trying as much 
as possible to ensure that I am fluent enough to make everybody understand what I'm saying. Try collaborations, maybe. Identify a person who you are in the same uh, niche with. They might give you ideas and they will also show you some tips and tricks on how you can improve on your channel. Always be open to collaborations, but make sure it's a collaboration that will add value to you and the person you are collaborating with. I also have a video on that. You can check it out. I'll try and link it somewhere on the screen. Before you ask for collaborations, you have to factor in some one, two, three. Otherwise, it will just be a waste of time. Thank you guys for watching. I hope this video was helpful. You learned something or two. Make sure that you're doing something that you're enjoying. Identify a niche that is working for you. Because after monetization, your hard work is your only determinant as to how much you will receive from YouTube. Thank you so much for watching. Please, if you haven't subscribed, do remember to subscribe to this channel. And also, share, like the video, and let's catch up in my next one. Bye.